Good evening, Madame and Monsieur. This is Phantom Phoenix, and we're back in Grim Fandango. So, we spent the almost entire last episode exploring the city and talking to different characters. There were a many of them, a lot of them really, and I got some idea of how could I solve all those tasks I need to solve, the puzzles, the objectives, uh, but I, I'm, I'm, I don't think I have all the necessary tools to do that yet, um, and also I still have this area to explore the High Rollers Lounge, which I just got into. I just arrived here, so let's see what's in here. Whoa. That's some scary looking um, creature. You pushed the barrel into something, and that was. Hmm. Looks like cans of some sort of canned meat. Oh, I really hope this isn't where the old race cats end up. <laughs> yep. Looks like more of that cat meat or whatever that is. Okay, cans with meat. What's this? I got a hunch the wine comes out here. Oh, it's a wine barrel. Yeah. And yeah, because Charlie said that he needs the suitcase located somewhere in the wine cellar or something like that I don't know I think he mentioned the wine cellar can I take some of these I don't need any cat meat or wine not picking that up whoops no 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 you're spilling uh -uh. stop doing that what are you doing I wanted some wine. Oh, look at what a mess you have made. Get out of here! Hey, what about my vino? It's not self-serve. You'll just have to wait until I get around to it. Hmm, so I guess we can't do anything we want. Um, at least not, on, not when that guy's around. Looks like the pantry. What's a pantry? It's a pantry. Oh, it's just like a storage thing. Looks like more of that cat meat or whatever that is. Oh, come Looks on. Looks like more of that cat meat or whatever that is. Looks like more. I don't need any cat meat. Okay, so nothing but cat meat here. Okay, let's see. what. What's this? Looks like a turkey baster. What's a turkey baster? I don't know, but let's take it. We'll gloss over that for the moment being. Oh my god, he is creepy. Now that guy really needs his beauty rest. Wake up, is it? Hey! I'm trying to get some sleep over here. Sorry, don't mind me. Just passing through. To where? The elevator. Doubt it. Going down? Probably. Later. Can't I go down to the cellar? It's a wine cellar. Wine goes down there. Maybe you could take me down now? Oh, yeah. I could take you down, but I can't eat customers anymore. Oh. No, down in the elevator. I want to go down in the elevator. That's true. They wouldn't see me hit you in there, but I still get in trouble. open the elevator door then they really see us fighting I don't think he wants to get us to the cellar how about a bribe look at me what can you give to a guy who has everything hey let's beat up that waiter not a bad idea but he's new give him a break I don't want to fight I just want to use the elevator chicken why can't you hit customers anymore exactly it makes no sense. Okay. Nighty-night. 
Okay, so that didn't get us anywhere. Hey! I'm trying to get some sleep over here. Okay, nighty night. <laughs> okay, so that's as far as we can go with that guy standing there. So, there's that. Let's move on. There's the waiter. Busy as ever, I see. Hmm. <laughs> Busy as ever, I see. <laughs> okay, that's it. Oh, there are some people here. What the hell is this? Who needs a giant 24 karat gold cat? Ah, who needs a cat, period? Whoa, that's a lot of gold, man. Good kitty. <laughs> I think they've noticed me walking out of here with that. Yeah. Okay. There is something upstairs. Is there a way to get up there? Um. Oh, there's just a way to get back to this area. Okay, never mind. Oh no, there's staircase. Oh, okay, stairwell. There's another area up here. Let's see if there's something useful in here. I guess there isn't. Uh, besides these monitors. Race results. Race results. I don't have the remote and I don't think they get any other channels anyway. Race results. Okay, so... If at some point would be interesting in race results, we know where they are. Let's go talk to that guy who's sitting here. Boy, that Nick sure gets around. That's someone called Nick. Nick Virago. What are you doing working in the High Roller Lounge? I would think Maximino's private lawyer would have his own office. I do, but they don't serve drinks there. Got a little lipstick on you, lover boy. Oh, that's the guy that was in the... I already got rid of that. Well, I can do the same to you, Calavera. Okay. He keeps a key in this box. So if I were you, I'd keep my jaw shut. Ah, uh, that's the guy who was kissing the lady in the... What's the name? Black casket? Nick, I need a lawyer. Do I? Do I really need a lawyer? Nick, I need a lawyer. You get yourself in some kind of trouble, Calavera. No, we just need someone for the dunking booth over at the club. Huh. Someone's claiming my roulette tables are fixed. But your roulette tables are fixed. Exactly. That's why I need a lawyer. So will you be needing a regular lawyer or an excellent lawyer? Um, let's go with An this. excellent lawyer. Any excellent lawyer or the best excellent lawyer. Come on. What does it matter as long as they're excellent? It matters if the guy you're up against has got the best. Then I guess I'll need the best. And who would you say that would be, Calavera? Who would you say is the best lawyer you know in all the land of the dead? Let me guess. You? You are, Nick. That's right. And that's why Maximino retains me on an exclusive basis. So, sorry, but I don't do odd jobs. So all that talking it was his way of telling us that he's an exclusive lawyer and he works exclusively for Maximino? How's tricks, Nick? Yeah. Everything all legal with the kitties? Everything all legal with the kitties? Yes. They keep themselves pretty clean. Who do you like in the fourth race? Well, there's a white-footed tabby in gate two that's looking strong, but has a slight eye infection. But you think he's going to pull out of it and win anyway, right? No, that puss-eyed puss is going to lose. But nobody knows, and I'm going to make a mint. I have to tell this to someone. I hate cats. Me too. But they keep the lights on around here. Virago, I really need a lawyer. Well, my dance card is full. 
So what are you gonna do? Hmm, I could pay you, I could ask Max, I could force you. I could tell Max... Oh, this is interesting. I could tell Max about you and Olivia. I could tell Max about you and Olivia. That sort of claim could send a man like Max into quite a rage, especially if the messenger had no proof. Max and I are friends. He'll believe me. People believe what they want to believe, Calavera. And I want to believe you're a smart man who doesn't go around spreading dangerous rumors. I've got to talk to Max for a moment. When I get back, I hope you're gone, because I'm sick of looking at you. Okay. Wait, um... Uh, oh yeah, that's what I thought. It's Virago's cigarette case. Yeah, man. Man, this is gonna get me in trouble. There's something rattling inside. Must be in a hidden compartment somewhere, but I don't see a latch or anything. Yeah, that looks suspicious. Okay, so nothing else here. What's this? Nothing. Okay, so... There's that. I don't think it would be a good idea to barge into Max's office while he's meeting with Nick. Ooh, that's his office. Oh, so I don't want to go there. Okay, stop right there and get out. How do we get out? Yes. So there's uh, the blackmail angle and... I did review my previous videos as I always do. I always see something useful in them and as I recall someone took a picture of uh, that guy and whatever her name was that he was kissing and the blue casket so there's that angle but I also have a pretty good idea of how to deal with one of those tasks at least I think I have an idea about how to take care of Naranja but I'm pretty sure I'm going the wrong way or am I Yeah, well, this worked too. Okay, so I do want to go to Bla Blue Casket and take that drink that the waiter was serving. This guy is still knocked out, so that tells me something. And the fact that Naranja is always drinking from that bottle while he's getting his tattoo is also telling me something. So you might see where this is going. I just need a way to get that drink. Strong stuff. That ought to kill the pain. And to take it somehow to Naranja. Strong stuff. That ought to kill the pain. Hello! Hmm. No effect. Nope, no effect. Did anyone else had that drink? What's this? Labor so organization and revolt made easy. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Because labor revolt was something that one of those bees was talking about. I'm gonna take this. Hey, can I borrow this book? Why? So you can freak out our plans for organizing labor and go rat us out to your pal, Chief Bogan? Hey, I'm just looking for something to read on the can, all right? No dice, Cumberbund. What, they think I'm stupid? Yeah, he's looking at it. He wants it. Hey, no dice. They think... Hmm. Let's see if we have something in our inventory that can be useful. What's this? Manuel, I am sorry to hear that you have not heard from your meche. You must be patient and let your heart remain open. If it is meant to be, you will someday be reunited. Ha! Ah, he still thinks I'm in love with her. Oh, wait a minute. I'm a member of the underground movement. So why don't I try to do this? 
Hey, did I ever tell you guys that you remind me of my friend, Salvador Limones? Salvador Limones is a fairy tale, a spook story the man tells the masses as he puts them to sleep. Idiot! Salvador Limones is a very real and a very great, great man. He also writes a mean letter. What is this? I, Salvador Limones, salute you, Manuel Calavera? A great ally in this noble revolution. You really know Salvador Limones? What's he like? Why didn't you tell us you were a freedom fighter, Manuel? I can't talk about my underground gig, man, where I put the whole scene in Dangerville. Wow. Heavy. Hey, uh, I've got a split, so, um... Viva la revolucion. Oh, man. Yeah. Now can I get the book? Would you cats mind if I dug on this book for a while? Knock yourself out, brother. Yeah, okay. Now we're getting something. Somewhere. But, that's not why I came here. Can we get something out of her? I don't think so. What I wanted to do is... Get this. The sink is full of dirty hookah water. Uh, I think that's the only thing we can take that has that drink in it because the waiter was spilling the drink. Now I just need to... Uh, I just need something to put that drink in. Hmm. What if I drink some of this drink or all of it and then empty the bottle and then use the bottle to take the stuff? Well, maybe just a sip. Just a sip? No? I don't think I could swallow any more metal right now. Wait, metal? What metal? Uh. Whoa, that's some... Did that drink contain metal? Uh... Why did he say metal? Let's see, where's the bottle, dammit? Ah, Marillo de Oro. A very fine liqueur filled with solid gold flakes. Oh, so solid gold flakes are literally gold flakes. Wow, I didn't thought of that. So great, now we have metal in us, inside of me. Oh wait, metal! Ah, I think I know how to use that. But I'll get back to that later, let me just... This looks like the dropper. Looks thing. like a turkey baster. Let's try to. It's empty. Do this. All right. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Okay, so let's put that in our pocket and let's go to knock Naranja out. Yeah, I hope I will be able to finish at least one of those puzzles in this video. Man, it didn't look like much, but this is taking a long time to complete. This area is huge and there are so many people and so many items to consider and so many areas and some of them I didn't even I don't know even what they're for. For example, that lighthouse that is locked. I don't know. Or that cat litter thing. I didn't see any cat, but there was a bunch of sand and cans with cat food. I don't know what that's for either, but the way these games work, absolutely every single item is important in every single location. So, was this here before? I think these are binders of tattoo designs. They're labeled nautical and nice, and a third one just says Anchormania. What the hell does that mean? I told you, Calavera, not now! Not now, but when I think these are binders of tattoo designs. They're labeled nautical and nice. Me and Shep. <laughs> Me and them from your bell, Pofayat. Okay, so never mind that.
And this inventory is getting quite big. Which is a good thing because we have a lot of items, but not good for navigation. Nah, he'd see me do it. Oh, he'd see me do it. Okay, uh, so I, I think I know what to do. I already done this thing before. Yep. And now they're gonna stop doing it. In the meantime, I will just take the thing again and try to pour it now. Oh. Who is over there? Yeah. Need a poke but Look, you broke it. Now it won't shut. Okay, I can't move. So I guess the cutscene is not over yet. Nemozogia, hold still. What are you? Dead? Kaifa, wake up. I don't work on drunks. Reisek Chavargo. What kind of sailor are you? Can't handle bulls, huh? What you the Osgon on Lord? What anger at the Nemfox? Give his at me. The Taliashen Boland watch. Well, let's go. Toto, I got your boy Naranya here. Am I here? Well, he sobered up. I send him to Limbo. Yeah, yeah. He'll make it there by morning. Promise. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That is what I told him. Well, Are that's... you kidding me? That's not what we wanted to hear. I gave him the like idea in the first place. In the ah, yep. Tiger can't change his stripes. Unfortunately, Toto called Velasco and told so, him... you still going? Let's see what you got on you, huh, sailor? Hey, listen to me. You got to take care Seaman of yourself. Seaman and Selmo Naranja Ensign Third Class. Yeah, oh, yeah, dog yeah, tags. Yeah. Are those like dog tags? Doesn't look like you'll be mm -hmm. showing up to work mm -hmm. in the morning. Well, I don't know. I already searched him pretty thoroughly. Sure. So he searched him. Okay, so... Sure, of course, I understand. So I think there's more to it. Definitely. Hey! Velasco! Manny, do you mind? Artist at work here, eh? Oh man, mm -hmm. his snoring is mm -hmm. so loud. I can't even think. Hey! Velasco! Manny, do you mind? Artist at work here, eh? You've got guts. Ah, uh, hang on a second. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh. Get away from that! So, what happened after dinner? Uh-huh. I think these are binders of tattoos. Oh, you're kidding me! Okay, let's get out. This snoring is getting on my nerves. I can't even think properly. Okay, so I guess this is not it. As far as Naranja's puzzle goes. But I managed to get his ID and now I have to think of some way to use that ID and I think I know what that might be. Now... If you remember... No, not this way. Wait. Yes, this way, because I have the book. What's the buzz, boys? We work and we don't you be easy for you. I wanted to do this. I think these are the words you're looking for. The workers shall control the means of production the workers shall control the means of production yes that's it that's what I've been trying to say yep I figured who will stop the fat cats of industry from building these ships with the pollen of the exploiting working class I say we fight back yeah. hmm What's this? Maybe a bee agitator? I say lay down your tools right now and show the man just who makes the honey around here. That does it. 
You know, I always thought bees came in two colors, yellow and black. But you look all red to me, my friend. Ah! Hey, what are you doing? We've got the right to assemble peacefully. Good. You're going to need a lot of assembly after we take you apart, comrade. Betty! Get me a lawyer! Get me a lawyer! Hogan, that's gonna make it tough to spring the kid and get him back out here. Good thing I know a lawyer who owes me a favor. Okay. Every time I think I did something useful, I end up being more messed up. God damn it. So, I guess no tools this time either. No. Nope. So, what are you guys doing to free Terry? Hmm. Guess it's up to me. Yep, so I guess I have to do every everyone a favor before I can get them to help me with my objectives, with my tasks. Okay, so I guess we'll have to free Terry from prison at some point by f by by making the lawyer work for us. Oh god damn, this is getting so complicated. <clears throat> what I was I don't even know what I was trying to do. Yo oh, yes. I was trying to get to morgue. Because uh if you remember in the last video, which thank God I'm doing this because if I wasn't recording all of this I wouldn't have a, a clue what to do. Just as I don't have a clue w w which way the morgue was. But since I watched my earlier videos, I noticed that uh, the guy from the morgue, whatever the name, mem membrane, membrano, membrio, oh, yeah, membrio. Uh, he said something about not having enough. Oh, that was loud. Okay, he was talking about how he doesn't have uh, means to identify the corpses so since he doesn't have the means why don't we give him something to identify the corpse but I'm gonna leave that for the next time because this episode is getting long enough so thank you guys for watching stay tuned if you like the video hit the like button all that jazz and I'll see you later take care